So a couple of months ago I made a video on a UK game that looked really really nice and actually had a lot of potential. Well now this game has released and as you can see it looks absolutely incredible. So in this video I'm going to be checking it out. If you do enjoy make sure you drop a like and also subscribe but let's get straight into it. Okay here we are then. So I'm sure all of you if you saw that video you will recognise this place and you will recognise the whole map except it's just got a whole lot more detailed. Everything is so much more detailed now we've got the whole map that's properly built if you remember there was a lot of gaps and things and a lot of things that weren't completed but now it is we've got all of the scenery all of the grass and everything like that is all in place and the vehicles actually work along with the teams so we're now on the civilian team they do have a really really nice role play um avatar section so if i go to settings here you'll see all the teams here we will check these out uh, in just a moment but on customization you can see there's loads and loads of things you can do so you can change your skin tone to whatever skin tone you want i'll just leave mine on the default one you can change your face as well to loads of different faces you can change your hairstyle there's a lot of different hairstyles you can choose from which is really really nice i'll also keep mine on the one that it was on this one i think you can change your hair color as well so there's loads of different colors you can become an old man if you want you can change your shirt there's quite a lot of shirts to choose from i will say i think it would be nice if there was a lot more um shirts that you could choose from but there isn't really but it's okay there's also a lot of pants you can choose from as well um but i have noticed that they don't really work for me but obviously the game is early access so let's not worry about that while we're here we'll check out the ones for highways england so we've got like a highways england um little thing here i'm not sure what that is oh that's a police hat let's just get that removed quickly um and yeah if we go to ambulance as well we've got a really nice ambulance service uniform if we go to firefighter a very nice firefighter uniform there's a nice firefighter helmet as well the firefighting team is not a thing at the moment but it definitely will be soon if we go to police we've got some very very nice police uniforms we've got some really really nice police vests what is going on outside my house right now okay there we go that's that fixed um so yeah we've got loads and loads of police vests even like a camo vest which isn't very realistic We've got a nice high vis jacket here and we've got like a normal jacket I think somewhere along here. So there is quite a lot and obviously we've got tactical operations as well which if you don't know in the UK is like SWAT. So we have some nice uh, SWAT vest, this is a tactical operations vest um, and then we also have uh, like the proper, the grey one like this and then if you go to accessories as well you can actually add on uh, the helmet. There's the firefight helmet I was talking about by the way, very very nice. You can add on the uh, tactical operations helmet as well so you can get a really really nice looking tactical avatar here but let's not worry about that at the moment let's join back on to the civilian team so you can see highways england and fire service is coming soon um you can see i'm not these levels but i do have access to them obviously to make this video so very very exciting we will be checking all of them out but if we run back over here into the uh, car dealership we will grab vehicles so there's a thing that i really really like about this game that i think makes it stand out against all of the others and that's that there's the system to buy cars is a bit different you have to actually go over to an atm interact with it insert your card just by clicking it but then you can see you have if we look at the top here we have a bank balance and we have a wallet balance so right now i've got 211k in my bank and 23,000 in my wallet i'm just so rich like that uh, but we can deposit so i've got 23,000 in my wallet if i wanted to put like 3,000 in my bank then you can see it goes down 20,000 and this gets 3,000 added which i just moved and then if you want to withdraw it or if you want to buy something you have to take it out of your bank so withdraw like 20,000 maybe i don't know and you can see i now have 40,000 in my account and 194 in there so it's very very cool how that works um but let's spawn in the vehicle so it's like a little screen over here uh vehicle spawner so we'll spawn in the r8 convertible very very nice car i think uh, in my opinion it does look very very nice so once you spawn a vehicle it spawns like over here you can run over here and have a look at it so the vehicles are very very nice in this game there is one thing i don't like that is the driving thing it's like the free model roblox one but i assume with time that will obviously get changed like with more updates and things but here we are we've already kind of explored the map to be honest when i reviewed it so i'm not going to spend too long driving around the map we've got some really nice like houses and stuff over there which i think looks pretty cool uh there is a place i want to go over here which you guys will recognize i don't know if it's the same in america but i know in the uk it definitely is so obviously over here you can see we've got a uh little starbucks that's trying to not get copyrighted very very nice you can't go in this one but over here 
We don't have a McDonald's, we have a Donald's, okay? And you can actually come in here. So this is very, very detailed inside, actually. So if we look at this, this looks really, really nice. We've got really, really like nice detailed chairs. And this is like exactly how they look in real life as well, which is crazy. You've even got like a back area here, which doesn't do anything. There's nothing in here, you can't do anything. And there is also a little drive through here as well, which is really cool. You can drive around the back and get served again. You can't actually do anything. It's all just role play, of course. But it's very, very nice in here. I do really, really like it. But yeah. Uh, that is just a little bit of the map and uh, you can see we've got 3,000 uh, you just get similar to ERC how you get paid to be fair but a little bit differently of course because it's not copied uh, we also have like a Burger King down there which obviously has no interior as well and I'm not really sure what that is probably like a restaurant or something maybe I don't know but yeah we've got the fire station here again I went in that in my other video go check that out if you want to see what this game looked like bear in mind when I made that other video it was not that long ago uh, so they have definitely done a lot if you did see that video a lot has changed since then um, so it's very very exciting of course but if we go down here kind of towards like the main police station area this is all my wi-fi give it a chance give it a sec it's loading it's my wi-fi it's not the game don't worry guys it is my wi-fi here we go so this is in towards the back of the police station so sadly the police station does not have any interior but what i'm gonna do is switch over on to the police team and then we'll quickly have a look at that and the tactical one and then we'll go on to the ambulance and the criminal there is a lot to explore in this video okay so police team i already showed you the vests and stuff but here we go i don't know if this is a tactical vest or the normal vest i think it's a tactical one to be fair because police normal police vests don't normally look like this in the uk but vehicle spawn here we go they're not the most detailed at the moment but there are some very very nice cars if we look at the vehicle purchaser uh we've got this one which is like the uh i don't know what this one is but let's just buy it because we can afford it oh no mind i can't afford it i don't have enough cash in my wallet we have an x5 um whatever this is and then if I go to ones I already own, we have the Peugeot 308 and the 5 Series Estate. Let's spawn in the 308. It's kind of like the, the signature police car uh, for this game. So as you can see, the police cars do look very, very nice and detailed. I must say, I do quite like them. Uh, they do look pretty nice. No interior, of course. Um, but yes, yeah, so here we go. We're in it. So we've got some very nice things here. If we turn on front lights, you can see they look pretty cool, to be honest. I like the lights up here. It would be nice if they were a little bit brighter, but I still think it's cool. Uh, and then obviously we have... 999 so if I turn on my desktop audio you can hear what the sirens sound like they're pretty nice I guess and then we'll switch sirens yeah I think they sound pretty cool to be fair so yeah these are these uh the police cars it is very very nice to drive around in them I must say it does feel very nice I really like the speeds of these vehicles as well like it's very realistic like you can't just floor it and be at like 100 miles an hour I do think the roads are a little bit small and tight yes it's realistic but at the end of the day it's Roblox so I think they do need to like understand that most people can't drive in Roblox and I think maybe they should be a little bit wider but I do kind of understand that would mean they have to do a lot of work they're not that bad I think they're fine but it would be nice if they were a little bit wider so maybe if they expand the map at all they should just bear that in mind but I think they're fine as they are but let's join now on to the tactical operations the tactical operations are the ones with guns so we'll check out the little gun system there that's pretty cool uh, but here we are so again they don't have any interior there's nothing you can get here either uh, these are just some guns that you can purchase which I'm not bothered about purchasing at the moment to be honest so exit there you get two guns for free on the tactical operations uh, so we have the Glock 17 here as you can see very very nice so automatically when you get it out it points it down I also like how your head like looks where you look but it points it down whenever you get it out but you can hold Q or but you can tap Q to aim it or you can hold right click and as long as you hold right click it will go like that there is a first person to it as well which is pretty cool uh, or you can also go over the shoulder as you can see by pressing v which is also pretty cool now when we shoot it is quite nice to be fair i do like the shooting system these are some little npcs which we're shooting right now uh, obviously you can't kill them because they're not real players and then we have this gun as well which is more like a rapid fire gun if going first person looks pretty cool to be fair i do like the guns we can see uh the bullets that i wasted yeah there they are look all the bullets on the floor <laughs> and you can also see the shooting marks as well oh hold on you can also see all of the shooting marks on him it literally concrete because he's a npc but oh well. <laughs> and also the uniform on here as i said looks very very nice as well let's spawn a vehicle there's only two vehicles for this team it's the x5 and the discovery arv i'm sure all of you uk lovers will want the x5 so we'll spawn the x5 here we are very very nice it would be nice if they had the firearm star on the top they don't the only sign there is that it's firearms vehicle 
well really is these two at the front which you can barely see but it's still cool i guess so yeah we've got the nice sirens again and the, the whole 999 thing pretty cool again very very nice to drive i do really like driving the cars in this game but there is one thing I've just noticed, and that is that this side of the road is much wider than this side of the road. Is that meant to be like that? I don't think that happens in the UK. I assume that's maybe just a development issue because it's fine here. Yeah, so there it is. That curb there goes in more than this one, so it makes that side of the road shorter. I think this length of road, this width, is perfect. But I know like this road is not the same as this road, I don't think because this road feels a little bit tighter and obviously the roundabout as well this inner lane is much smaller than the outer lane for whatever reason but yes very very cool let's quickly check out the ambulance team uh, and then there's not really much you can do on the criminal team uh, if I, I think you can like rob an ATM so we'll check out the criminal team quickly after the ambulance team so if we choose the ambulance team real quick you will see that it is pretty cool to be fair I must say here we go uh, oh okay my wi is too bad here we go here's the hospital there's no interior on it at at the moment but it does look pretty cool it's all just loading in i can imagine when that is interior this will be so nice this looks like incredible to be honest we got the sprinter ambulance this is the main one there is another ambulance it's like a, a reno ambulance no one really uses it it's quite disgusting one thing i do like about these ambulances though is that they do have a little interior so you can't like stand in them uh, but you can like sit down in them i think yeah so you can sit on the stretcher as you can see so if you're actually role playing the, your camera is really weird on this what is going on here uh okay so yeah if you're sat on these obviously really 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 realistic someone can be driving a very nice interior and obviously if we hop in the driver's seat here again very very nice lights and sirens on this look very cool same sirens as on the police team which i don't know if they have the same sirens on all of their emergency vehicles in the uk never really thought about that to be fair but i think they're close enough so it doesn't really matter but yeah pretty cool uh there's like no tools or anything i don't think for this team now there's no tools so can't do anything so let's check out the criminal team okay here we go so we are now on the criminal team now bear in mind that i still have this weird uh helmet thing on obviously that that part of it isn't fixed just yet and another thing to note actually is with levels up here so you can see my level uh, up there to join onto teams you have to be a specific level if you don't want to wait to that level then you can just buy it with robux or you can um just level up by playing the game so every team you can unlock for free you just have to level up and if you don't want to wait then you can just buy it but it does take quite a while to level up especially to like the really really high like firearms tactical commanders or whatever i said but anyway here we are on the um criminal team now so i think there are some tools over here that we can actually buy so you can see we can buy some guns for robux uh, or we can buy these guns here for uh, a lot of money and when you die you lose them by the way so you might not want to waste all your money on that but let's get a rfid a knife and a drill there we go and i think you can actually rob things in this game so now we've done this if we head over to the uh car dealership there's an atm in here so let's see if we can rob this i'm not sure if you can or if you can't but we'll find out so uh let's see oh yes we could drill it i'm not sure how oh here we go reading card yo this drill is cool by the way wait what card is it reading I don't get it wait i think this is reading other people's card maybe so maybe i don't know i don't know how this works guys but it does look really really cool and i'm sure there is someone on youtube that explains this much better than i can but that is all for this video let's reset so this goes off my screen um thank you very much for watching this video if you did enjoy please make sure you drop a like and also subscribe make sure you check out everything else from the description as well we are on the road to 100k which i'm very excited for of course but like i said thank you so much for watching and hopefully i will see you in my next video bye <laughs>